Hello, and welcome back to Loverboy 821 Plays, Pokemon Red Randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, today, I have friends. Hello, I am Yeet. Yeah, I'm still here too, I'm Jay. <laughs> yes, anyone who isn't new to my channel, which is a small majority of you, uh, Chadwick has been in videos before, like when we tried to do Stardew Valley and got our, uh, got bored immediately. Stardew Valley is hard to play, though, dog. You can I don't... I do not understand how to play Stardew Valley at all. Oh, who dis, bitch? Uh, Pokemaniac. 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 Oh, yeah. Fuck, I needed to heal. I was... I was not at all paying attention. I was just... Oh. So, you uh... You to get them cheeks clapped, boy. Probably. Uh... <laughs> we need to get... We need to get chaos in here. So that way me and him we go off on the cheeks okay, clapping you thing fucking... again. <laughs> Never mind. Oh. Oh, she got she got clapped. Bird Jesus. Pokey maniac. Oh, this is episode eight, if I didn't say that. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was, I was so caught off with the fucking What's Pokemon Maniac mean? I I think they're just the Pokemon equivalent of a furry, truthfully. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Like that's my best guess. That character icon was a dude, but the person you just fought was a boy, or it was a oh chick. Fuck, Jesus Christ! The you didn't uh, that. part of the uh, randomizer is I randomized all of the names. So, like, I fought oh. Lieutenant Surge a couple of parts ago, and his name was, like, Ashley or something. <laughs> um, Lieutenant Ashley. But, uh, yes, this is a randomizer, which means we don't know what Pokemon we're going to run into. And this is also a uh, Nuzlocke, which means if any of my guys die, they, uh, they are actually dead. So this is just Japanese version of Pokemon. What? <laughs> what? Random. Wait, but the forgive my uneducatedness, but I believe Pokemon originated in Japan. Yeah, but in the Japanese version of Pokemon, the Pokemon actually died. Oh, really? Not yeah, in the yeah. video games, only the manga. I mean, huh. yeah. Still, the manga was way fucking darker. Oh yeah, I remember in the first fucking like issue of that, like uh fucking sand slash cuts and Atkins in half. What the fuck? Yeah. They didn't pull punches. That's fucking badass. Or like Q they showed a Q bone that had been completely melted down to his bones. Back when dog fighting was allowed. I mean at least less frowned upon. God damn it. It was always frowned upon, but I want I want a Starmie so bad for my team. It would so round out my team if I could have a Starmie. You got a whatever the fuck this thing is. Do you have things? I, I do you have water Pokemon. You don't need a Starmie. <laughs> Why would you name it Bio? Uh, because Muck is just a biomass. <laughs> oh, that's Muck and not the uh. The okay. dragon thing with the fucking... I'm thinking maybe I should go over my team since you guys just got here. Uh, for... I mean, I'm not going to understand a lick of nothing, so... <laughs> I, I have Muck. Okay, Muck. Uh, who has these moves. Uh, I just need to know what Pokemon you got. I have uh, Jessica the Sea King. I have uh, Bird Jesus, who's a Pidgeot. A Pidgeot or a Pidgeotto? It's a Pidgeot. The uh, Pidgeotto is the second form. Oh, okay. Uh, we have... This is my starter Pokemon. Uh, we have Ruby the Scyther, who was... Why is it a B? In the... Buzz. Did you not hear the randomizer portion of this whole thing? I don't like that the fucking Pokemon don't match the goddamn icon. Oh, because in red, they... Just they like they just have an icon for bug type, bird type, water type, monster type, snake. Yo, Jessica, what's going on? Oh, that's... <laughs> uh, we have an Aerodactyl, 
which is pretty fucking Radio cool. Sore. And then we have uh, Arbok. <laughs> Your monger. <laughs> Your monger ender. Uh, slaughtered that why name for Why not have named fucking uh, like an Onyx or a Steelix or some shit that Onyx is a first edition Pokemon. Yeah, but Onyx is the worst Pokemon in the game. Is he? Yeah, Onyx is a shit Pokemon. Huh. Like, his defense stat if is okay. If you get Steelix, it's fucking great. Steelix is actually good. Steelix is actually but, uh, good, but he's not until second gen. Yeah. And even in second gen, he was not easy to acquire. Oh, fuck no. In fact, it makes me... It, he was so not easy to acquire, it makes me eat mad that he's easy to get in gen 8 because in gen 8 there's just steelixes like walking around you can go catch and i'm like motherfucker in you... fucking gen 2 you had to like you had to get one of the steel crystal things that you had to do a bunch of trading and shit to get him and you had to choose between him and scissor and scissor was like the coolest fucking pokemon yeah it was either yeah that was bullshit and now it's just like here you go yeah, I know, right? I was, like, I was like, on the one hand, I'm happy that I can get a Steelix. On the other hand, I'm mad at the kids these days. Executor. When I was your age. Oh, back in my day, we had to walk from the Pokemon Center all the way back to the Pokemon Center. Executor <laughs> wasn't in first edition, though, I don't think. Who? Executor. Executor was a first-gen Pokemon. I thought that it was just the first evolution of the fucking eggs. Nah, the Executor was like the Maybe. best grass type in the Gen 1. Oh shit. Um, oh yeah, also for the Nuzlocke rules, if you two aren't familiar, as I can only catch one Pokemon in each route, and it has to be the first Pokemon I run into, so I don't actually get to choose who I have. Oh no. Uh, I haven't been here yet, which means I can catch a Pokemon, so you're about to be here for me catching another Pokemon. Oh boy. I also have to name them so oh. that I get emotionally attached. <gasps> Fuck yes! Okay! Alright! Alright! A cadet. Now, so what happens Ooh, if man. it runs away? Because they can teleport. <laughs> if it does, I cry. That's all that happens. Spoon Man. Spoon Man here. To, to run psych. away. Okay, it didn't run immediately, but it might run whenever it gets lower health. The thing is, my guy's so much higher right. level that I can't hit it, so I just have to throw Pokeballs and prick. <laughs> Apparently, in, fucking, uh, in Diamond, I had nope. to do that trying to Cut. catch. Oh shit! Okay. Can you uh, can you evolve Pokemon and shit? Um, I don't think I can evolve Kadabra, but even Kadabra is just fucking awesome. Yeah, but Alakazam. Alakazam is the best guy in the goddamn game. Yes, I know. Does my mic echo? It tells me that it lights up. Um, it's not echoing for me. Okay. In that case, I'm assuming that it's just pretending like it's fucking hearing something. Uh, would you guys like to do the honors of naming my first catch this episode? Spoon Boy. Spoon Boy. Spoon Boy. <laughs> All right. Call him middle spoon. I'm sorry. What? Call him middle spoon. Middle spoon. <laughs> he's not the big or the small spoon. He's <laughs> he's the middle one. Middle spoon. Middle spoon. He's absolutely going in my team when I have time to power level between parts. I don't know who I'm going to get rid of though, because the person I don't I like. Get rid of Jessica. Jessica's my favorite. How dare you? <laughs> Are all the starters randomized too? Yeah, my starter was uh, Scyther. Oh shit! I don't know if that's good, but I mean, he looks edgy. I like so. Scyther. <laughs> Not a terrible Pokemon. But the move sets are all randomized, so he's actually really good because he has actually good moves, which usually he doesn't. Oh fuck! So you could fucking. You have a Charizard with the moveset of a Blastoise. Yeah, like, I, uh... I'm pretty sure... 
fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Just taunting me, because Middle Spoon will never be the Big Spoon. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna Earthquake you. <laughs> uh, Yeet, for you who don't know much about Pokemon, if you ever play the first Pokemon games, Pokemon Red, Blue, or Yellow, the secret to winning is Earthquaking all the motherfuckers. Oh. So just stun locking them to no end? No, it just does no a ton of does. damage. Oh. Emerald, Ruby, and Sapphire were better. Don't at me. <laughs> at Chadwick. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if they're better. Fortunately, none of my Twitter ads are that, so I can't get harassed. I can't get stupid opinion. I doubt you'll get harassed because Emerald, Ruby, and Sapphire are the most overrated gen of all time. I'm sure everyone else heard you say that when I like this Chadwick fella. He should have fucking be on more often. Overrated. Okay, Grandpa. <laughs> hey, no, my favorite is Diamond and Pearl. I'm not saying that it... Pokemon to be fair, that me. was... I played Emerald a little bit, but I didn't really get into Pokemon until Diamond. Yeah, Diamond and Pearl were the shit. I played the fuck out of Diamond. I had, all, like, an entire party of level 100 fucking Pokemon and shit. My Torterra was just unstoppable. I remember... I was a degenerate and picked fucking Torterra. Torterra became my favorite for the dumbest reason. Because, like, I had all of the Pokemon in Pearl, because I played the shit out of it, like, 800-something hours. Um... But I was power leveling everyone by fighting the Elite Four, and I would do that by Kai. I had a bunch of XP shares, and I would give the XP shares to a bunch of low level Pokemon, and then go in with like my level 100 Mewtwo and just kill them. Jesus. But for whatever reason, my level 100 Mewtwo fainted. Like, it got hit by like a fucking ridiculous crit or whatever. Um, and then uh -oh, the, I had to keep throwing in my level 30 Pokemon to die, like, because you can't just leave the battle. But then I threw out my level 33 Torterra and used Earthquake, and he proceeded to take down the entire Elite Four by himself. I'm telling you, Torterra, <laughs> big boy. He's, after that, he was like my favorite starter for a while. I was like, all right, sorry. I went into the fucking Elite Four fight not expecting to win, and I ended up just dummying all of them because of him. I was like, all right, well, this worked out well. Torterra, great Pokemon. Plus, he's like that, uh, that fucking... What? What mythology is it that they have the fucking tortoise with the, uh... The tree of life or whatever the fuck it is on its back? Uh, Poe the Kung Fu Panda? <laughs> <laughs> no, you mean Avatar the Last Airbender? Uh... <laughs> That's a legitimate fucking... No, no, I know. I'm trying to think. Yeah, no, we're with you. I have no fucking idea. Fucking Appa. <laughs> the flying yak thing. Yeah, could yak. Don't talk bad. Flying bison. It was closer to a yak than a bison. <laughs> Suspension of disbelief. I'm, I'm not southern enough to know the difference, I'll be honest with you. Yeah, same. Well, a yak isn't from the south. No, but people well, see, that's about how animals non... is from the south. <laughs> yeah, but see, that's how non-southern I am. I'm confusing a yak being from the south. That's how Yaks south are I'm from not. the Himalayas, apparently. That's what I. Hmm. Bison, on the other hand, some of them do live in the Midwest. So uh, yeah, I was about to say in the Midwest. So <laughs> see, you have an unfair advantage. You can look at it and be like, "That's not a fucking bison." Fucking lion ass kid show. <laughs> That's because it wasn't supposed to be a bison. But it's called a flying bison, my man. It's a flying bison. It. What? Yeah. Appa's a flying bison? Yeah, that's yeah. what he's called in the show. Look it up. Those motherfuckers. Look it up. <laughs> Personally offended. That's just a yak. <laughs> uh, I know what it is. They didn't think that anybody would know what a fucking yak is, so they were like, bison, everybody knows what that is. Okay, I'm gonna switch out. 
because uh, that is super effective against everything on my fucking team, actually. Except for maybe Jormunder. Jorgenmunder. Appa, the sixth six legged fucking flying bison yeah. that doesn't even look like a bison. Mm hmm. I'm triggered now. Good. If I, uh. If I had a picture on standby, I'd put in the fucking video what, uh. What Appa looks like right now. I, I found it. It's pretty easy. I just typed in APP and it, the first one was Appa Flying Bison. Yeah, it would just it would just fuck up the video though if I like clicked off of the yeah. game and then like started. No, it's edited in post. I could edit in post. All right, anybody who watches this, I want you to know that Avatar fucking lied to you. That's not a bison. <laughs> Way closer to a yak. Are you comparing the two images now? I mean, I just... I know what a bison looks like, and it ain't that. <laughs> and then I looked up a yak. Definitely closer. Maybe they just call him a flying bison in the American version. Like, bison have like well, I mean, a it was made in America. Oh, Avatar, right. Avatar is an American... I know, everyone I thinks it's an anime. About that. 100% whoever called it a bison didn't know what a yak was. Guaranteed. Or they didn't even think of it. They weren't wonder, caring like, about being accurate. I wonder, like, if in Japan, do they just call it, like, a flying yak? <laughs> they might not know what a yak is. They might not know what a yak is. Okay, Who knows? Okay, we're gonna go with Drill Peck. I assume anybody not from the Himalayans... No, is that a fat man? Yeah. Dude, was that fucking Peter Griffin? No. <laughs> is that Peter? Why does everyone have a goddamn <laughs> Kadabra or Alakazam in my goddamn Nuzlocke? It's because they walked into the same patch of fucking grass you did and grabbed one. My rival's starter Pokemon is a Kadabra. Oh God! Eventually, it's gonna be an uh, Alakazam because I said it that his starter will evolve. And yours can't. Oh, my starter doesn't have an evolution. Oh, well, not your not well not your uh, not your starter, but your. Uh... My Kadabra. Kadabra. No, because how you evolve Kadabra is you trade him to someone else's game, but since I'm playing on an emulator, uh, I can't trade him to that's anybody. That's shitty. You know, I always hated that Pokemon did that. Like, oh, you gotta trade if you wanted to. That's dumb. I don't like that. Especially fucking... for somebody with no friends. Well, yeah, let me let me be fucking alone. <laughs> let, Stop rubbing let, it in let, my face let, that let's, I don't let's have Let's be friends. real. If you're playing Pokemon, there's a good chance you don't have any friends. Yeah, yeah seriously. which is why they did that. They were like, get fucked, kid. You don't... <laughs> get fucked. You're never gonna get this evolution. Go start your life. Get your Kadabra. <laughs> or you just do what I do and buy two Game Boys and two copies of the game oh, so I can God. trade to myself. That's... That's the expensive That's option. Sad. It is really sad, isn't it? <laughs> Thank you guys for being my friends. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think I'd ever have friends. Oh, come on. Uh, Super so, nerd. Yeah. Just out Jinx. Wow, that is the most fitting. We all know what he does with that Jinx. Oh, my God. <laughs> but he's not even a Pokemaniac, Chadwick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but he's a super nerd. Well, would you say that he squirtles with her? Oh, God. Oh, no. I would say that he probably tangulas with her, though. Uh, stop, both of you. Enough. Uh, we're done. We're done. New line of jokes. Let's get to a new bit, okay? Let's go to it. Let's move to a different bit. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. He's getting really much choked up. Oh my god. Well, now this one has an Abra. <laughs> How did this dude get a level 20 Abra? I don't. Motherfuck that shit should have evolved. I, I fought a person with a level 20 Magikarp and it made me so fucking heated. I was like, why? <laughs> why is it a Magikarpidos? Dude, Magikarp is the most OP fucking I guess you could always just elect to not fucking evolve him but just get a level 100 Magikarp. He's overpowered, I'm telling you. The, uh... No. Yeah. I also randomized the 
gym leaders, which has led to a couple of disappointing gym leaders, namely Misty, oh, no. whose Pokemon consisted of a Weedle and then a Kakuna. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Wonderful. But we're about to catch another Pokemon, boys. No oh, idea shit, what it's going to be. Yeah. With a fucking... Well, uh, isn't it entirely randomized? Like, there's not a set spot to, yep. to get it? It's com- it's completely random. It's just each patch of grass I'm up. Like, Kato. Woo! Oh. Okay. You guys should come on more often. I'm getting way luckier. You were about to fight that. Uh, yes, I was. <laughs> <laughs> you were about to kick his shit in. <laughs> Murder is so like ingrained in me mentally that I'm like I don't know what to, I don't know what to do, which is fucked up because in your Nuzlocke, Pokemon just die. If they go down, they're fucking dead. <laughs> That's true. We play for keeps here. No, see, my head cannon isn't that my Pokemon die in battle. It's that if they fail me, I put them their Pokeball in like a hydraulic press or something. Oh my and god. That's what kills them. Wow, that even <laughs> that darker. Is this dude is up. not. Are you a drow? Are you a drow? <laughs> Sound like a drow. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, trying to get into the mindset for our drow campaign. There you go. <laughs> Only three Pokemon have deemed to fail me so far though in this round. Only three Pokemon have met the hydraulic pest I have named Bob. <laughs> oh, I make, I make I make Ruby hit the button so he knows she knows what will happen if she oh, fails God. me. <laughs> Kangaskhan, parent Pokemon. Oh, that's his name. That's a good fucking name. Okay, what are, <sighs> what are we calling Kangaskhan? Chungaskhan. Chungus. Why? Why did you have that ready immediately? <laughs> I don't know, Chadwick, you have any, anything other than Chungus gone? I, I was just going to say, just leave it at Chungus. <laughs> just Chungus. Okay. I don't know, I like Khan. I like Khan. Da, 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 da. That's a V. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Chungus. I don't. That's have... a U. Instead of an A. It's Chung. Wait, is it? It's Chungus. U-N-G- Not Chungus. There's not enough room for Chungus Khan, so. Chungus it is. Which is kind of bullshit because Chungus is the same amount of yeah, letters you could as name Kangus. Him Big Chungus. Fucking Big Chungus. Here we go. Big Chungus. <laughs> That's a V again. Chungus. Don't don't mind me, guys. I'm just fucking dyslexic. It's okay. I am too. Biggest ch- big chungus. We got a big chungus. There we go. The biggest chungus. Unlike the middlest spoon. The middlest <laughs> spoon. All right. <laughs> Even with other middle spoons, he's still the middlest. The most middle spoon. <laughs> the middlemost <laughs> spoon. <laughs> Is this the place I'm going? Nope. It's the this one. Yo, bitch, I want your lunch money. <laughs> hey, yo, bitch. Got a cold. Where's my case. money at? Yo. All right. We're not going to go gambling this episode. We're going to go gambling next episode. But, uh. Come on, I got to feed my addiction. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, fucking. What? All right, uh, I have to go beat up a Team Rocket guy for his lunch money now. Just beating up everyone for their lunch money. <laughs> I'm gonna go rob a dude. Be right back. <laughs> to be fair, he is in the mafia. I feel like True. I feel like I feel people, like it's fair game. Fair game. Fucking has a whip. If you join the mafia, it's fair game to get robbed now. Oh, this poor dude. Oh no, he's about to get slapped. <laughs> and dead. Instantly fucking dead. I bet Ruby just used one of her scythes to cut that thing's fucking head off. <laughs> My god. It's a Hutor! You know what you're weak to. Also flying. Which is fucked, because he's supposed to be a dragon type? Uh, no, he's a grass psychic type. 
What? I thought that it was a dragon type. The Alolan version, which is a different subspecies, is a dragon grass type instead of a. Oh, is grass that type. the is that the one with the big neck? Yeah, neck for days, oh. yo. Neck. I always wonder why there are two executors. Executors, executors. I'm going. We pushed the button and we found the mafia's secret hideout. We're not going back. Oh, look, just a second. Um. Oh, look, a nine-year-old found the Mafia's hideout. I mean, I'm a nine-year-old with a bunch of monsters. If that makes it any better. You're a nine-year-old who just cast summon monster like 20 times and are walking in there with an army of wolves. <laughs> Death. Destruction. Dome. You have chosen death. Uh, so I think that just about wraps up this episode, actually. Oh shit! Uh, it went by pretty fucking fast. <laughs> Got uh, to the next town. Capture. Got to the next town. There you go. Uh, thank you all for tuning in. Bye. You're welcome. <laughs>